That homeless encampment outside of St. Louis City Hall is no more. Good evening, I'm Ann Allred. And I'm Mike Bush. A mayor's spokesman says about three hours ago, the last tent was removed and dozens of people moved to shelters. We have live team coverage tonight. Brent Solomon talked to those glad to see the encampment go. But let's start with our Robert Townsend, who has reaction from those who called that place home. Mike, tonight City Hall is finally tent free. You can see back there all those colorful tents that once took over the grounds here are all gone. The city has now put up dozens of locked metal barricades all around City Hall. This sign says this park is closed for restoration. The clearing out of a controversial makeshift homeless encampment at St. Louis City Hall was an all day event. Under the watchful eye of police, the city said the singles, couples and families with pets had to go. It was heartbreaking. I never thought I would be in this, uh, this situation. Gino McCoy says he and his wife were former business owners in Phoenix, but suddenly homeless and living here when they moved to St. Louis with their three dogs three weeks ago. I just literally had to put my kids in, in foster care, you know, because I can't. Two dogs. Yeah, because I can't. I can't take them with me. For more than a month, these people had been living in the tents on the lawn of City Hall, some right under the office of Mayor Tashara Jones. But the city decided to break up the encampment at 10.01 p.m. Monday by enforcing a curfew law that effectively closes parks in the city between 10 p.m. and 6 a.m. unless a person has a permit. We don't want to leave this. I don't. Seeing their tents broken down brought Gino McCoy to tears. This is the only place where I can keep all my dogs and keep my wife. There. This was home and they took it away from us and that's wrong. Many of them are going to other shelters and other locations where hopefully they could get the support that they need. Nonprofits also showed up to help the nearly 40 homeless people transfer from tents to the city's federally funded Tiny Homes Transitional Village near Jefferson and Del Mar. The city says another goal is to help them find jobs. This is not leadership. This is not what leaders do. Now the mayor says, quote, the city took action to save lives and protect people. I talked to our spokesperson earlier tonight. And he tells me the encampment also was cleared out here without any problems whatsoever. Live downtown, Robert Townsend 5 on your side.